What's up, my friends? Yup. Welcome to this amazing day, my friend. This day is for you, my friend. This day is for you, my friend. This day is going to show you just how dynamic you are. But remember, you got to go first. You got to go first in everything because God gave us all a free will. So you got to go out into the world showing your worthiness and showing your, uh, uh, your, your willingness to be the change you want to see. So in other words, you got to go out into the world and show your willingness to be an inspiration to other people. And that's when you'll see that this day has your best interest at heart. That's when you see just how dynamic you are because we all got to go first. And then the universe will match your efforts, my friend. Hopefully you're feeling amazing today. But you got to do the work to feel amazing each and every day, but not until you first have a gratitude session with God. Because life is just like real estate. Whatever we appreciate increases in value, but whatever we don't appreciate decreases in value, even your life, my friend. So go ahead and have a gratitude session with God. Show God how thankful you are for life because you didn't have to make the cut. There's many people that thought they would make the cut and enjoy life today and they're not here. They didn't make the cut, so you got to show some gratitude to God for thinking enough of you, for giving you another chance to get it right, right? That's your first and primary responsibility each and every day. And immediately after that, you got to put on your amazing, my friend. That is what gonna get, that's what's going to give you your superhero-like powers, yep. Just like Clark Kent going into the phone booth as Clark Kent, but coming out as Superman, yep. The same situation is for you, my friend. You got to develop a morning routine that will allow you to be your best possible self. Reach out to me. I can help you with that, my friend. I got clients all around that are doing that, that, that are taking leaps and bounds, right? Exceeding all expectations in and throughout their lives. And that also can be you, my friend. I am the owner and CEO of Greatness Coaching and Consulting, my friend. Reach out to me, I got your answer, right? But I got a collective answer for you today. That's why I'm here, because I've been giving you a new tool each and every day to help you win this year. But before you win the year, you know, you gotta ask yourself, how do you eat an elephant? One small piece at a time. So before you eat the year, before you win the year, you gotta win each minute, each hour, each day, each week, each month, and ultimately, you can't help but to, to win the year, right? Because the better you can resolve micro challenges that bring you closer to getting macro rewards, my friend. So if you just take care of the little things, your big rewards will make itself available to you, my friend. See, I know what you've been feeling, my friend. You haven't been at your best self. You've been overwhelmed, not really with external stuff, with the internal things. You've been in pain mentally, my friend. You've been getting challenged more than ever before, my friend, and for some reason, this challenge is shaking you up a little bit, my friend, but don't worry, we're all human. We are all a work in progress, but the way that happens is once you stop doing the work, that's when you stop making progress, my friend. I'm here to tell you the work that you need to do so that you can turn that pain into power, my friend. That's the least that life can offer you, my friend. I'll give you an opportunity to turn your pain into power. And the opportunity is there. I'm going to help you to see it. And I'm going to help you to, 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 to grab it. And I'm going to help you to maximize it, my friend. But you got to learn how to turn your pain into power. Let me tell you about life. Life is all about pain management and acceptance. Life forces us to accept the things that we cannot change, right? And here's the caveat. See, once you learn how to accept the pain, the challenge, the adversity that's in your life, that's when you gain valuable access because you gain the power to turn your pain into power, my friend. It's an acceptance job. Let me tell you why. Because all adversity, all challenges, all pain, comes with the equal, if not greater blessing. Now again, the pain comes free and easy, but you gotta fight and you gotta be patient long enough to secure the blessing, my friend. Yeah, here's three reasons why you gotta turn all your pain, not some, but all of your pain 
into power, my friend. Number one, here's the thing. When you first get that pain, you got to embrace the pain, although regardless of how heavy and how painful it is, you got to embrace it. Look it head on and then pass it off to God. You first got to embrace it. I'm not scared of you. I got the solution for you. Greater is he that is in me than he that is in the world. You can't defeat me. You looking at pain straight in the face and then pass it off to God. He said, I will never leave the righteous forsaken nor a seed begging bread. That's the formula, my friend. And number two, here's the thing. Never isolate yourself mentally when experiencing pain. That's gonna make it much worse, my friend. Never isolate yourself mentally. You gotta understand that everyone's experiencing some kind of adversity. Everyone's suffering from something, my friend. Never isolate yourself mentally, right? And number three, here's the thing. You gotta develop a greatness mindset, a mind bold enough to believe, right? That life is always happening for you, not to you, regardless of what it may look like or feel like, my friend. Life is your friend because it's always happening for you, not to you, regardless of what it may look like or feel like. So that pain, that challenge, that adversity that comes your way, it don't look like your friend, but you already know that life is happening for you, not to you. So you got to embrace it and accept it as your friend. And then what's going to happen is it will become your friend, my friend, because all adversity comes with the equal if not greater blessing the adversity comes free and easy so just embrace it and then you gain the access to turn your pain into power let me tell you something else about you my friend you were born to be great